He's a 13 millimeter, he's a half. After you get all this off, you're gonna take that little bar right there, lift it up, push it up right there. Get it to come loose. Now, I ain't gonna take this, I'm gonna take it all the way off, but right now I'm just gonna loosen it. Oh, yeah. All right, get it from this side. I just loosen it like that, and what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go break this pan loose. Get that drain down. But look at that fluid, boy. See, I'm glad I caught this when I did, boy, because it looked like I got some, some damn bearing probably burning up and no, boy. Look at that damn fluid. Duh. That ain't good. That ain't good at all, boy. That shit. Oh, no, no, no. That's, that's, that's straight. I forgot I put that on. Oh, no. Hell no. I see it look like little pieces of. See the little metal flake in there, boy? I mean, don't get me wrong. Now, you're going to have uh, somewhere. But see, I forgot I used that purple um, power in here. So that's some good fluid to use, you know. Especially if you're going to be driving at high rates of speed. And then they got the friction on. You got Man, the dog on dogs, bro. My dogs gonna be holes in the damn thing, boy. Oh, Jesus, these fucking dogs, boy. I tell you. I mean, you just, I mean, it be the darnest shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, they just be fucking with shit, boy. I ain't, I got mechanic dogs, boy. That shit crazy. All on my motors and shit. I tell you, boy. Now this shit finna leak in here. Taking the last boat out now, by hand. Put it on that. Add it on that. I'm gonna pull this on off. Like that. Oh, I think I gotta reuse the gasket. I'm gonna sit there down and grab this with both hands. Hold on. Oh. I lift that up over it and bar. Gotta go grab me another gasket. See it. Yeah, the gear look good. See that? I say it was that's that purple. Um, see how I look that purple color. Now you see it is a little weird in there, but it ain't you know it's bad. All this, like I said, all this stuff in here is new. So and I don't know if y'all can see, but y'all see that little C clip right there? It's a, it's just partial ways around it. What I'm gonna do is, I'm finna push in, well, first thing first, I'm finna go put this bad boy in neutral. Put it in neutral so I can rotate my gears because it's a eight millimeter that's holding this pin in right here. Once I put an eight millimeter, I, I can push the pin through. Once you do that, you gotta be careful. And I see me, I already know how to set the gear so if my fall out, it ain't no problem. But y'all on the other hand, you know, you gotta, once you do that, it takes two people to do this, honestly, because you're gonna have to push in right there enough after you get the pin out and pull the C-clip out, and then you'll be able to pull the whole shaft out. Once you pull the shaft out, you'll be able to pull the bearing and the uh, the seal out. 
And um, even though my seal leak and my bearing still good, you already there. Just go and replace them both. You know what I'm saying? And so that's what I'm doing. But uh, I ain't finna hold this phone and do all this. I got a, I got my little setup, my GoPro to strap around my head and everything. I'm going to get there eventually. I ain't the day in the day. I'm trying to go ahead and knock this out because I don't want to be out here in the sun. Even though I'm in the garage, it's still hot out here, and I ain't trying to be doing this all day. So, this your boy, Boss Man. Like I say, man, anybody needs some work, get at your boy. I'm out. That's on game.